everyone. You're watching the Culver City Beat. I'm Juliette Lamar. This week, the Wendy Museum announces its virtual events for 2021. And Assemblyman Richard Bloom has announced he's running for county supervisor. So stay tuned. But first, I want to tell you about our sponsor, Santa Monica College. They have over 90 fields of study. They are a proud leader among California's community colleges and transferring students. So there is a seat for you at Santa Monica College. So find your classes today. Our top story, who doesn't love just a little color in their life. Well, Beautify, L Beautify Earth is transforming walls across the west side by incorporating art from local artists. We have the full story right here. I'll be right back with your local news after this. It was called Stinkin' Lincoln and no one wanted to look at it. I was like, all right, we, let's do something about it. I started to do something, I started to do something about it. I started. Um, work with folks to get approvals and create some art. We can either work on one-off uh, wall projects or we work in large-scale uh, projects and manage sort of arts programs for cities and corporations. They have reported um, on average receiving uh, about 20% increase in revenue. And the campaign is to work with sponsors uh, or the landlords who are willing to continue this movement on Pico and help bring um, more, more business uh, and more life to Pico. And now for what's happening in your neighborhood. Fun things are on the horizon for the Wendy Museum. The museum recently announced a compelling line of online programs you can enjoy virtually in 2021. The Wendy Museum has developed a calendar of unique weekly and monthly offerings such as monthly art, past, present, and future series, virtual Friday night films, and 3D tours of the current exhibits. For a calendar of events and recurring offerings, you can check out their website at wendymuseum.org. Assemblyman Richard Bloom from Santa Monica announced Wednesday he will be running for office in hopes of taking over Los Angeles County Supervisor Sheila Cool's position in 2022. Bloom's campaign will focus on creating economic recovery, combating climate change, and preserving natural spaces. Bloom mentioned his admiration for Cool and added he wants to build upon what the supervisor has already accomplished. Well, that's all the news that we have for you today. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I'm Juliet Lamar, and you take care.